In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. On the sixth day, God formed man from the dust of the ground and breathed life into him, naming him Adam. God placed Adam in the Garden of Eden, a paradise filled with lush vegetation and abundant fruit. However, God saw that Adam was alone and decided to create a suitable companion for him. He caused Adam to fall into a deep sleep and took one of his ribs to create a woman. Adam named her Eve, and they became the first man and woman. God blessed them and gave them dominion over all the creatures of the earth. He also provided them with the freedom to eat from any tree in the garden, except for the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. God warned them that eating from that tree would bring about death. One day, a cunning serpent approached Eve and deceived her into eating the forbidden fruit from the tree of knowledge. Eve, in turn, gave the fruit to Adam, and he also ate. As a consequence, their eyes were opened, and they realized they were naked. Feeling shame and guilt, they tried to cover themselves with fig leaves. When God walked in the garden, Adam and Eve hid from him because they were afraid. God confronted them about their disobedience, and they admitted their wrongdoing. As a result, God pronounced various curses upon them and the serpent. To Adam, God said that he would now have to toil for his food from the cursed ground, and to Eve, he declared pain in childbirth. However, God also showed mercy. He provided garments of skin to cover Adam and Eve, symbolizing the atonement for their sin. God then banished them from the Garden of Eden to prevent them from eating from the Tree of Life and living forever in their fallen state. The story of Adam and Eve serves as a foundational narrative in the Bible, illustrating themes of human disobedience, the consequences of sin, and God's mercy and provision.